on, we're just outside of our home off of uh, in the uh, Port Midway Road. And the grizzly, I think the belt broke. We were on our way to take pictures of Nickerson Pond and, and do some video, but so we're going to tow it home. The old grizz got to be towed by the old grand am there. No, well, we'll get a rope on it. That was a ball that wasn't very good for our. Hey, what's. Well, I guess our picture expedition wasn't meant to happen today. Oh, here, I'll give you a hand. You want to turn it around? Or... Look. Nice to have two vehicles, because at least we can, you Just, know. Just uh, steer this one towards me when I uh, pull the head. Yeah, I'll get this rope out of the way. Okay, we're towing my bike home. Our big camera expedition didn't work out. Banging my metal right up to my front. I don't want it all bang. Which one is it? Yeah, that's all right. It's loose. Now that's pulling it in. Yeah. The other way is loosening it. All right. This is all very interesting.
wood is so close that it, it shouldn't have been that close. Some further do we can push it up that way? Yeah, that's what we'll do. I'll pull it ahead. Between that and now it's raining, man. We were just not meant to leave the house. No. I'll leave it right there and then we'll, I'll push you in. Yeah. Boom. Never know when you're gonna off my other cloud bike. You never know when then you're gonna need this stuff. There she is. Well, we meant to go get pictures and we end up coming back home towed, so I guess it wasn't meant to be. There we go. All done. Well, I guess we weren't meant to do that. Well, this is what broke my belt. Here's the old belt. There it is there. That's the old belt. That's what came apart. That's why we towed her home. Anyway, we, I had an extra one, but still gonna have to get a new one. It was an older belt, but it worked. So it's kind of neat, an old uh, technology that's from the snowmobiles. There she is, it's back to rights. I haven't had too much trouble with this Grizzly. We got a really good deal on it. Yeah, just like a little, just the technologies from the. Uh, technology comes with snowmobile technology which I never thought that an automatic would be work as good as it did I was kind of blown away that that this would you know this kind of technology like I thought well it's like a pussy's bike there you know somebody that drives a you know an automatic for a four wheeler <laughs> and anyway it were it's great it's anybody that doesn't have a four wheel this was a great thing to get you know automatic there it is. Put it back together God, I had another one of those belts. I wouldn't have been able to get it. It's good to take an extra belt if you're going on a ride because you may be 20, 25 miles in the woods or even longer and not be able to get out without one of these or be towed out. I recommend it. With, I, I always carry an extra belt, which is a good thing. I guess the gasket's good, isn't it? That's just a cover gasket, it's not a crucial gasket, I guess. No, it looks pretty good actually. She's back, and hopefully it will run. Well, I'm just kind of taking a closer look at this belt. You can see there's gaps out of it. It wasn't very healthy. And I've dro I drove the bike for a couple of years, and I never changed the belt, so. And it's, it's pretty bad. It's a bad belt. But I'll pick up another one. No, it's pretty broke. It's broken a couple of places, so. Oh, well, that's all it did. It just, it just stopped, and that was the end of it. It didn't make no big squeal or anything. I just stopped it and pulled it over, and it's really good. It's almost finished. There she be.